everyone, welcome to a video. One second. I made fun to it. Welcome to episode two of Falkland Big Friends. I'm just so sunny, I can't see. Here we go. Right. So that's the episode we got our starter. And looked around everywhere, talked to people, didn't talk to these guys. What are you looking at, kid? You, obviously, I'm talking to you. Mind your own business, we're just hanging out. Okay. The first encounter ever, it's gonna be a fledgling! Look, bird pop around it. Ember. I'm not really catching stuff in this one because I just want a good nice team, really. It's like the real game is here, I would. But I don't really catch many Pokemon when it's not the real game. Just rares and ones I like. But normally I would just be catching them all. Hey guys. So, not sure what they need. I mean, well, not lemons. I'm saying that Pokemon I want. Um, I might do more and more the series. Not every game I'm gonna play will be a series, though. Like, I might have, I might keep the score and I might not. It's not a game I potentially play all the time now, since I've played it so many times in the past. But yeah. But this is a pretty fun game, to be honest. Not a game I'm always going to be playing, though. I might start Project Pokemon game up. That's, if you guys want that. I might do it after this video, I don't know. That's if you guys want me to start a Project Pokemon because I can look through um I can look through a Project Pokemon game. I'm pretty sure I've got one that played. If it's still off, I might record it after this. Yeah guys, I'm actually, after this video, I'm gonna go do that. Yeah, sounds good. <laughs> What do you think? Keep it back in your head. I'm just doing this. Oh, there's any. Wait, what can we do? Wait, level up. Let's do the trainers now. Oh, 
Books and the most interesting Pokemon. Not really legendary, is it the most interesting? Or dragons make some Pokemon. Forgot which one, but dragons weren't mythical stuff. Because there weren't there's not that many types of it and they look good. And there's only other one weekly, I'm pretty sure it's self. I don't know any of the pieces that I have. Anyways, <laughs> a lot of people have nice badges. <sighs> Hopefully, I actually will continue this. I probably will continue both of the series because, um, what you call it? Um, since my Mega Series will be further updates. Not much content to record, not so. Yeah, also in the comments, suggest any games you want me to be playing because most likely I will play them. So, all you guys can enjoy the record views. The blue, the blue. Nice, nice, nice. Like I am having a feeling that I really want to do this whole series because I just love like after you've got like the second gym badges, I, I just really like the Pokemon game from there. Um, so the start of it, uh, you just have to play through that part really, and then you've got like the best bits the, from like the second gym basically. Now don't get me wrong, the start, of course, it's okay, but most games are supposed to make the start the best bit, not the end. But still, the start is pretty good. Not much action goes on. Oh, oh, oh. Best bits are in, in, my, in my opinion. Some people may have different ones. opinions, I'm not too bothered. At this point, I might train to a level 10. Yeah, I might do that. Normally, um, yeah. Also, guys, put in the comments below your favourite Pokemon or your favourite Pokemon type or your favourite Pokemon move of any type. So, could be signature moves, any, anything. Also, I'll put your friend Pokemon game as well, why not? Also, if you'd like to be friends, um, Roblox, because I went and cleared out everything. All my friends list, I have 10. 10 friends now, my main ones that I play with and that. So if you guys, any of you who watch, want to play, you can rather just send me a friend request or put in the comments your Roblox username and I will send you. No, actually, don't just friend me, put comment, comment your username and then send me a friend request so I know who to add. I don't want to add no, I don't want to be adding a bunch of people who don't watch my channel. It's still hard to see if I'm blocking this under the bucket, but it's normal. Wait, let's see you guys, it is a bit... Hey, be quiet. Hey, I'm back, guys. I was just sorting the stomach because I can't see. No level 10 yet. Nope. No level 1. Check out those two level 10. 
I got here as fast as I could. No. Something terrible has happened. I need you to come back to town with me. I eh? don't have time to explain. Let's go. Kenzie, I'm so glad to see you are safe. I'm sorry to be the one to tell you this, but Kenzie, but your parents have been abducted from their home in the short time you have been gone. Not much is known yet, but it is a that they were taken by a group of people known as Team Eclipse. You see, Team Eclipse is an organisation of people who have a unique perspective on people and Pokemon. They believe that people and Pokemon are not in harmony with one another and they have interesting ideas for how to solve this problem. They are also dangerous and not to be trifled with. What? They seem to do whatever it takes to accomplish their goals. I do not know what they want with your parents, but I suspect it has something to do with their skills as archaeologists. Your parents are familiar with the Pokemon of Legend of Moraria. Whatever Team Eclipse is after, I'm sure they're getting very close to achieving it. Now tell me, Kenzie, did your parents say anything about their work when you saw them this morning? So your parents gave you that necklace earlier. That's interesting. Anyways, it's not safe for you here now. Kenzie, I think the, for the time being, it's best for you to leave town. At least until we figure out what's happened here. Chessman Town is a good place to start. Just point out one. Careful now, Kenzie, don't go look for trouble. <coughs> hmm. Yeah? Da, 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 the parents are gone. I need to hear what told you. Head will be stronger. Watch out, make sure your Pokemon are prepared. I just recently learned that Pokemon get more experience when they battle train Pokemon than wild Pokemon. Wild Pokemon aren't as good at battling, so your Pokemon don't learn as much from them. Okay. Hey. <coughs> hey, over here. Trainer, this must be your first time traveling alone. Dot dot dot. I see. Your parents were abducted by Team Eclipse. That's terrible. I have some information about Team Eclipse that might be valuable. Follow me to my homework and discuss it privately. Um. Why don't I actually get a choice for this? I want to go and get my parents back and I'll talk about it. I'm so so your parents were taken by Team Eclipse. Gosh, that must be awful. I bet you must miss them. Oh, so they gave you that necklace before they were taken. Do you mind if I see it? Thanks, this necklace looks old but valuable. <laughs> Thanks. Give me my necklace back. I would stamp on a bed and pee on it and poop all over it. But it won't let me. Hey, there you are, Kenzie. Who was that person who just took off when you were out with her? Wait, what? She took the necklace? I saw her in the woods just outside the town. Quick, one me and I'll leave you there. Yes sir, yes sir. Right after I start talking to every person I see. Sorry, but we're currently doing construction on the bridge. We should be done soon. Sorry for the inconvenience. Oh, that's so... Yeah, that's... 
totally. It's just there so we can go get our necklace back. I used to own a surf shop on the Sweet Little Island. It got hit by a tsunami and a tornado at the same time. Like, when does that happen? Like a double disaster. people. It was hard my husband when his squirtle passed away. Very strong bonds can be made between people and Pokemon. I made a large donation to this town some years ago to build the Squirtle Fountain. My first Pokemon was a Squirtle, and after he passed away, I went to town with him by having a statue built. <coughs> but this is very nice. <sighs> My grandpa really likes Pokemon. They were the only friends he had growing up. Well, that's sad. So, you must be a Pokemon trainer. Make sure you take good care of your Pokemon. Pokemon are your friends. Don't forget that. Ah, that's expected of a person like you to say. My wife and I just moved to this town. We wanted to start a family outside in a big city. He wanted to move here to start a family. I only agreed because this town is Starbucks coffee. Okay, you only have one bed, so I don't know how this is going to work. Uh, what the? What the? There's Pokeball here. Oh, that's work. Oh, oh, it's, oh, it's a Pokeball. <coughs> it's a Pokeball. Oh. Couldn't the items just be what they actually were on the floor instead? Mostly to you. I don't need to use this, no. Oh, wait, there's people inside there, though. The building over here is the Pokemon Center. There are several things you can find inside. First and most importantly is the nurse behind the desk that heals all over your Pokemon. Second is the PC where you can store and switch your Pokemon. Third is the mark from which you can buy useful items. Have you seen that photograph on Facebook of Danny and what she said there? Ten past one. Oh, there's a person See that girl over there on the counter? She heals your Pokemon. Yeah, I just got to hold everything. Yeah. Yeah, just got some of coffee. Look at these people. Like, oh my gosh, I can't believe he did that. I know, right? Like, he didn't even give me money for winning the battle. Uh. My Pokemon and I love the coffee here. The natural runs help my Pokemon work up and get moving faster. Especially helpful for Pokemon battles. Starbucks is such a beautiful Pokemon. It has four different forms depending on what season you catch it in. Okay, and this person. I have my coffee every morning. It gives me a great speed boost. Welcome to Starbucks Coffee. We're having a special today. It gives out free samples of our famous Starbucks Coffee. Here, you have one. <laughs> I especially enjoy drinking Sarsbrook coffee. Enjoy your Sarsbrook coffee. Poco especially enjoy the juice you get for it. Let's have you talk to you. No. I enjoy coffee and Sarsbrook coffee. Oh, what is She's in here somewhere. I don't know that right here she, she doesn't get away. You go look for her and get your necklace back. Don't you need to just look like coward. Yeah, this Oh, anyways, guys, this does it for this episode. Um, because we've done about one. Um, our necklace is stolen, but yeah, we'll see you guys in the next episode. Bye.